What is up, ladies and gentlemen of YouTube? It is I, Paul, from Not an Apple Fan, and I thought I would talk to you a little bit <laughs> about um about 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 CPUs being able to mine now. <laughs> Did you, did you know? Did you know that was going that was going to happen? That you won't be able to buy CPUs now because because of mining. Did you did you know that? Did 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 you know did you know that that's gonna that's a thing? <laughs> uh, I I wanted to put a little bit of uh cold water on this fire because sometimes you know people get a little bit. So uh, I'm gonna look up the CPU mining because I I guarantee that like that'll um new a raptorium crypto mining algorithm turns amd cpus with huge l3 cash into money making machines and it does right um the, the there's all talk about how much so uh as for the mining rate an amd ryzen 9 3900 can offer a 47 thousand hash whatever some sort of weird number uh, blah, 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 blah. uh ex Rain explains how you he can get an ROI for six Ryzen nine thirty nine hundred and two thirty a uh, mining system in two hundred and eighty four days. So yeah, apparently you can get your money back uh will uh, in the days, right? And here's why um the bigger cash the higher the profit. So uh, that will mean uh, bad news for Epic Milan <laughs> X CPUs. That will, yeah. So I would say that this is 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 not a thing, um, because the platform costs alone are ridiculous. You're gonna have to have a motherboard. You're gonna have to have RAM. You're gonna have a hard drive. You're gonna, you see, when you do a GPU mining rig, you can put several GPUs into one motherboard. So the one cost of that one thing is offset by having to just buy it once and then you can put multiple gpus into one motherboard there's specific mining rig gpu uh motherboards where you can put stack loads of gpus into one thing so yeah while gpus are expensive you the platform co cost is a one-time purchase for up to like 20 gpus or something like that whereas these things every time you buy a cpu a consumer cpu you're gonna have to do this the epic one's probably a little bit more attractive massive amounts of cash you can dual socket them and all that kind of stuff um but still not really going to be a thing right return of investment uh you're getting four five dollars a day uh while the 3950x can net you almost 350 usd so the 3950x can get you five, four or five dollars a day which is good like that's good for a cpu uh but the problem with this current currency is it's a shit coin nobody knows where it's going to go in terms of value it's going to go up or they go down bitcoin is you tends to be the predominant factor in whether bitcoin whether alt coins go up or down so it's just too fucking risky i we've seen this with shia uh you know hard drives got expensive for about a month and then it went away uh same thing's gonna happen here i think i think cpus maybe may get expensive for like a month and then go away this is not the same as gpus um in any way shape and form as i said to mine on a 5900x you're gonna have to have an individual power supply for that individual platform an individual stick of ram you're probably going to need a gpu of some description because they don't have in onboard video so how do you set it up so you're going to need a gpu uh you're going to need the chip itself then you're going to need uh, a motherboard did i say motherboard i can't remember you're going to need all those things and a power supply hooked into it with a drive to save your coin like yes that sounds great and you could use one mining rig to have that but imagine having multiples of those it would be become prohibitively expensive on a coin that doesn't like the reason why mining is great with ethereum is because ethereum is the second most popular coin therefore it's kind of like a, a solid investment if investing in crypto is an investment at all because i don't fucking don't know and uh, but yeah like so mining ethereum is a good thing or even just mining using a uh, nice hash or whatever it is you use where it just basically turns your crypto into cash for you and you just use basically renting your hardware to them and they're mining it and turning it into bitcoin or whatever they're using they're getting you the most uh, the best rates they can and so on and so forth so it's not the same this is a specific coin used using that they're using to mine 
uh to get and that'll just never work because those coins will never take over and especially because unless like somebody's gonna come out there with like fucking 20 cpu <laughs> sockets on a motherboard i don't see this becoming a thing in any way shape or form maybe with like an epic there's probably a way where like you buy one epic and then you can chop it up into like four cpus and that's probably more efficient in like a virtual machine environment and make like like this is a thought i don't know maybe it's way more efficient just to mine on one i haven't got a clue and then you've got two so you know these are a thought that i have you've got two uh cpu cores you can two cpu, two CPU sockets so you can have uh, dual epics and you can have the mining away i honestly don't know whether that's worth it or not and um, this coin just this seems like a story out of nowhere and um, you can see there is a dude and he has there's a video of him uh mining um where is hold on just give me a second i'll get and this is a dude that's actually doing it doing it um oh i get the, there we go Go away. There you go. There's a dude doing it. You see all of the, all of the platforms he's using to do it with. But like, look, look, he he needs a stick of ram in every one of them. He needs a cooler on all of them. Uh, you know, he's got sticks of ram in all of them. You see, he's got do like yeah, cost prohibitive. I would say, um, in a nutshell. So yeah. I, I honestly like what why <laughs> why would you do this uh probably because you can't afford to get into gpu mining uh, i don't think it's going to be a thing right i just i just don't believe it and i think there's people out there and they're going to get worked up and they're going to get stressed out oh i won't be able to buy a gpu i won't be able to buy a gpu i won't be able to buy a GPU, i won't be able to buy a cpu now you know uh no um but the it remains the it remains the same the, the the net problem is the same doesn't matter if you can get cpus doesn't matter if you can get ram doesn't matter if you can get hard drives doesn't matter if you can get cases doesn't matter if you can get anything if you're a gamer and you want to game because you can't buy gpus so it doesn't matter that you can't buy cpus because fundamentally it, it, it's not a problem if you still can't buy gpus like that is the net problem and i think people try and you know get a get panic about other things and yeah it's a problem if your cpu blew up or your motherboard blew up and you need a new one that's a problem i agree with that but however realistically anybody looking to try and get into pc gaming right now can't get into it because they just can't buy a gpu that's the problem anybody who ha is sitting there with a pc already most people don't upgrade their cpus that often if you do you're doing it wrong um cpus are great once you've got eight cores you're probably fine for the longest time six cores probably even good right like so you don't need a new platform what you need is a new gpu and you can't get a new gpu because of the fact that mining's going on and you can't buy them now when, when that will sort itself out that to, to that i leave to the majesty of god that i don't believe in but like i i genuinely just don't know when you're going to get gpus and that's the fundamental problem that's the sole core issue with the whole game pc gaming space pc gaming is dead for the foreseeable future it just is um, the only way you're going to, like, if you want a game right now, the only way you're going to get into gaming is, like, going onto eBay, typing in eBay, and then just, like, guessing at GPUs that you might be able to get for a reasonable price. Like an Orx fucking, or R9 Fury. Fury? Can you get a Fury? I don't know. Uh, there's a Fury water-cooled for, wait, 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 buy it now fury or not fury there doesn't seem to be any on buy it now so there, well that's gone that's not a thing uh or nine 290 not supported anymore by the way 290x can you get 290x but you now you can get one for 200 uh dollars or so yeah so this is the only way you're gonna get a piece of gaming now is by doing something like that uh try x four gigabytes of gddr5 and for some reason he's put x it's just gddr5 uh but like yeah you can that's that's the way you can get a piece of gaming out you need a gpu you're gonna have to pay like 200 dollars for a graphics card it should be about 50 quid in today's market but that's better than paying 1200 1500 2000 dollars for a gpu like that's just better in my opinion i would rather huddle an old gpu and just nurse it and get like low to medium 
on 1080p than to go out and spend fucking four times the msrp of a graphics card that's a fucking that's supposed to be 700 dollars. i'd rather do that i think that's probably the best option like buying a gtx 1060 what's a 1060 now uh gtx 1060 used their 250 that's better that's better than going out and spending all this money on a gpu that you can't what is what is a what is a nine eight this is a this is a good question what is a what is a 980 980 because that's that's 10 that's 1060 performance oh you can get a 980 for 100 and i oh, know that's that's a shitty cooler um it's around the same price like you know what i mean so like that's better but that's still not great and that's the only option you have now i wouldn't be panicking about uh cpus going missing because it doesn't matter um it <laughs> just doesn't fucking like it doesn't matter where they go it doesn't matter what they're doing you're not going to be able to game on them because you can't buy a gpu um yeah the 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 reality is if you want a gpu now if you want a gpu now this is what you got to do and if you want a cpu now there there are plenty available oh cpus are gonna go missing uh um what what it, let's just go to ebay oh not ebay um amazon uh or what, what, let's say or not rise the nine fifty nine fifty nine fifty uh yeah they're msrp they're actually below msrp uh for fifty nine fifty x fifty nine hundred x's are below msrp um so i don't see them going missing uh rise in nine fifty eight hundred x and you know what? It doesn't even matter anyway, because like if you're really stressed out, you can just buy an Intel CPU. What's a ten seven hundred K? Ten seven hundred K is three hundred. Oh, there's one. Uh, ten six hundred K is two hundred. So you can still buy Intel CPUs. It's not uh, three hundred for for a ten seven hundred K. Like, yeah, not a great price. Not particularly but i mean intel's gonna be there so i i would just not stress out about that like i would not stress out about the fact that you can't buy cpus because they're mining on them now and um, the the main issue remains the same and the issue is if anybody's looking at this thing and they're all like oh i want ethereum to fall to the floor well ethereum will fall to the floor when bitcoin falls to the floor the, the old adage still remains the same you gotta look at bitcoin you gotta be like is bitcoin gonna crash and uh it doesn't look like that for 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 at least another six months i'd say <laughs> so yeah boys we're in for a stormy stormy winter and i'll talk to you in the next one don't forget to like the video like the video dislike the video dislike the video but if you dislike the video tell me why dislike the video because i can't fix it if i don't do it wrong in the comments let me know what you think do you think it's going to be terrible 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 you can't be able to buy a cpu or what do you think i'm genuinely interested to hear what you have to think don't remember remember that um i have a patreon and a paypal i do i don't put mid-roll ads in my videos and i do that for you so if you don't like mid-roll ads but you want to support me you can hit the like button which is your magic power which tells youtube that i'm better youtuber than i actually am but if you want to support me in any way shape or form remember this content is a content like a busker i am a guy on the street with a guitar but instead of that i just give you my 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 plebeian low level a high level uh knowledge and thoughts on 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 the on on based on this 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 tech stuff right that's what i do so if you a busker a reward for what you think is a good video is you could go and think about joining my patreon or paypal or whatever and you get access to uh the after hours podcast with me and chris the good old gamer you also get access to my discord where you can talk to me directly and i do voice chats in there from time to time and you can also um buy some merch i'll talk to you next one go and press the button stop recording bye 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 bye